Hello everyone and welcome back to Everyday Husband Quotes, the channel for marriage advice, marriage entertainment, and everything else, marriage. Hey, hey guys and welcome, welcome back to the channel. Now Jenny Mai, who is going through a divorce from the rapper Young Jeezy, honey, it's all over social media and normally I would have my antennas tuned in to tell you if this is going to be a nasty divorce, but my antennas are so focused on the circus playing out on social media because everybody and their mama got an opinion. I swear. Any woman who has been divorced in that year, you know, you have red flags if it's not going to work. And any woman who has to be a single mom as a result from a divorce, that situation breaks my heart. And so it seems like social media is happy and is taking pleasure in the demise of this woman's divorce. And it has me asking the question, why is social media tearing her up in this way? Look, the truth is going to come out and I pray that when it does, it sets her free. It's only been a week and the internet is still dragging this lady because her husband been filed for a divorce and I don't know about you but I guess social media has to put their two cents in it because they've never seen a man file for a divorce but it does happen you know I feel like people instantly want to blame the woman when a man files for a divorce they're like girl what happened what did you do but also I feel that if a man asks for a divorce truth be told is it is almost unheard of for a man to file for one and does that mean that the man is at the point where he can no longer make the woman happy and that's why he's going to the drastic measure of filing for a divorce he's just choosing to deuce out and not put in the work to actually make the marriage happy especially with Jenny Ma and Jeezy being married for only two years competitive successful high-value black men marry women like Jeannie Ma. And so I don't know, what do y'all think? Is it uncommon for a man to ask for a divorce these days? And even though none of us have no idea as to why divorce is happening in the first place, honey, social media has done more damage than good by adding their two cents in a proceeding that has nothing to do with nothing. So like I said, there are some comments on IG that are dragging Jenny Ma. And one comment on IG says that she might be the problem at this point. Another comment read, I knew it was something strange about Jenny. And another comment says that I am here for the dragging. Never liked her. I don't care. And honey, that is hard to hear because a lot of us say that we are for women empowerment. And just because Jenny Ma is of a different color, it shouldn't change the fact that we should still be for women empowerment. And so another thing that I want to mention and I want to bring to our attention is that social media has been bringing up old clips of Jenny Ma saying harsh things about her ex-husband, Freddie. So we do know that this is Jenny Ma's second marriage to Jeezy. Social media is trying to rationalize how Jenny talked about her her ex-husband Freddie to say that this is why Jeezy is divorcing her. So in a resurfaced episode of Jenny Ma's old TV show called The Real, Jenny called out her ex-husband Freddie at the time for having a lack of compassion. And the caption says, child, if this is any inkling of Jenny Ma's character, I can see why Jeezy wants to end that marriage. And so in the clip, we're going to break down the clip. Jenny called her ex-husband a Mitch. And we know that you calling a man a Mitch is a derogatory statement towards a man. It's like calling the man a B word. So Jenny referred to her ex-husband as a Mitch by saying when Freddie was sick and his mom was around, Freddie seemed like a completely different man than she married. And so in my personal opinion, you know, who wouldn't be a little different if you're physically sick? Being sick does tend to make people act differently because they just don't feel good. They don't feel like themselves. So, you know, in this instance, I can see why social media may have dragged Jenny Mai for making that harsh comment about her ex-husband, Freddie. But it still doesn't excuse the fact that this woman may be really going through hell because of this divorce with Jeezy. And then another thing, she may be thinking that this is another failed divorce. And sometimes as women, we carry on that guilt to say it's my fault, the reason why it didn't work. And so another thing Jenny 
Jenny mentioned in this resurfaced episode is having a lack of compassion in her marriage for her ex-husband, Freddie. Jenny Ma's ex-husband said that when he couldn't get the compassion he needed from his wife, Jenny Ma, at the time, then he would go get it from his mother. And so maybe I'm reading too much in this, but I can understand a little of it why social media is dragging Jenny Ma. Now listen, if you keep living long enough, you will understand that people only judge your character based on what you show them. Jenny has showed us some things that will cause you to take a second look at her and be like, well sis, you may have got what you deserve. Because people tend to remember the bad over the good. No matter how Jenny tries to spin this divorce, I don't know if she will be able to recover from some of the past comments that she said previously and if people will actually be able to see the positive in her or if they'll just continue to reflect on what she previously showed them. So before I wrap up this video, is it uncommon in today's society for a man to ask for a divorce? So those are my comments. I look forward to reading yours in the comment section of this video. As always, thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Mm -hmm.